Hey everyone, and welcome to World Heritage Journey, where today we're at Skotskirsko Garden in Stockholm, southeast Sweden. So this is quite an unusual World Heritage Site because it's a modern cemetery. It was designed in the early 20th century by two young Swedish architects, Gunnar Asplund and Sigurd Liverens. Now it's located in the southern suburbs of Stockholm and it's situated on an old gravel quarry. And what's remarkable about it is that it's completely different from cemeteries that had come before. This is a large area with lots of trees and the burial plots are just scattered in various locations through it. It's very peaceful and contemplative. Let's have a look around. Despite being a cemetery, there are of course buildings here that were carefully designed by the architects and three of them, the most important ones, are behind me. There's the Woodland Crematorium and the Chapel of Faith, the Chapel of Hope and the Chapel of the Holy Cross. Now these were finished in the 1940s and they won many awards for their beautiful modernist styles and they're actually still in use today. There's funerals taking place later today. One of the distinguishing features about the cemetery here is the enormous groves of pine trees that surround all of the gravestones. It's very relaxing, very contemplative and very meditative as well. And it means that the focus is actually on the woodlands rather than on the graves themselves. Behind me is the grave of the cemetery's most famous resident, Swedish film actress Greta Garbo. A Stockholm native, she was interred here after her death in 1990. She was a star of black and white and silent films from the 1920s and the 1930s. And it's a really lovely spot here in the cemetery. It's on a small plateau elevated above the other graves and it's surrounded by a circle of pine trees, meaning that it's open to the air as well. It's a really lovely spot. Well, the World Heritage Journey has certainly taken us to some unusual places. We've been to plenty of ancient cemeteries before, but one from the 20th century is definitely a new one. And we've had to dodge plenty of things on the journey, you know, like tourists and bus tours and the weather, all that kind of stuff. But I've never had to dodge funerals before, so it's been an interesting experience. But it's a lovely spot and I'd highly recommend checking it out. But that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm Joel on the road and I'll see you at the next World Heritage Site.